guys and welcome back to another video so this week i'm going to be giving you guys a look inspired by my t-shirt so i am wearing a friday the 13th shirt and i'm going to be doing a look inspired on these colors from the t-shirt so for this month of october i'm going to be giving you guys a look every single week i know i usually post bi-weekly but this month in honor of my favorite holiday which is halloween i'm going to be posting a video every week for you guys with just different shirts and just a look inspired on the shirt that i'll be wearing at that time leading up to revealing my halloween costume so if you guys think you guys know what i'm going to be this year then comment down below where you think i'm going to be so i'm really really excited i already purchase my costume but i purchased some accessories from others um, websites like amazon and the spirit store so i'm waiting on all that to get here so that will be later on so without further ado let's get started okay so as always i already went ahead and prepped my face and i also did my eyebrows so i'm going to be using this palette right here from jack van hill also if you guys hear background noises it's very very windy outside so um that's the noise that you guys will be hearing there's not much i can do about the wind outside <laughs> let's go ahead and get started i'm going to be grabbing my palette and i'm going to be using mainly these colors down here and i'll be um, putting up the names of the shades for you guys here so i'm going to focus on these just because the shirt is like a burgundy red with black so let's get started so I'm starting with some eyeshadow primer. This is the NYX Proof It. And I'm just going to apply that on my eyelids and with my finger blend it out. Kind of pat it, not necessarily smudge it, just patting. So also guys, before I get started, I just kind of want to throw it out there that I'm not like a professional at makeup. I did not go to cosmetology school or anything like that. I just simply am a normal girl who loves makeup. I enjoy doing my makeup and I also can only do my own makeup. I'm not that good at doing other people's makeup, but I'm not a professional. So if I do things wrong, if I don't blend things well, if you know, whatever the case is, then um, it's just because this is what works for me. This is how I do my makeup. This is the way I like it. This is something that I would wear. I'm not saying that this is the way you have to do it. I'm just showing you what I do because I've had people in the past say, oh, that looks good. How'd you do it or whatever? But I'm not here trying to portray that I'm a professional because I'm not, I didn't go to school for this. I'm gonna go ahead and grab my this shade right here using my JH37 brush. I'm going to grab this shade right here. It's called Crazy. And I'm going to apply this on the crease right here. Almost looks like burgundy slash purplish. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and grab this shade right here. It's called Perfectionist. This shade right here. And I'm using my Lexi brush in style 250. And I'm just going to dab it a little bit. And I'm going to apply this under my brow bone to kind of blend this out and soften up this color. So now I'm going to go ahead with a flat brush. This is the JH41 brush. I'm going to go ahead and grab 
the black color right here i love this color because it's like black but it has glitter on it also so i'm gonna go ahead and grab that and i'm going to pat that down on my eyelid Okay, so I went ahead and applied the black and I also had to do a lot of my cleaning here I just used the makeup removing wipe to remove all the fallout I had because black always gives you a lot of fallout So I'm going in with my same um, JH 37 brush the same brush. I applied the Burgundy color this one here and I'm gonna go in with this um, It's called live in my best. So it's this red color just because i feel like we're kind of going into like purple direction and that's not where i want to go so i'm going to grab that and i'm going to place that on top of that other crazy color that i put right here and also grabbing a little bit of the black to blend it all together Next, I'm gonna go ahead and grab my JH37 brush. It's a little bit of a thinner brush and I'm gonna go in with the same red, the Live In My Best, and I'm going to apply this to the bottom lash line right here. Okay, so don't get scared guys okay the look is gonna come together i know it looks a little bit like what the heck but keep in mind it's also halloween season so this is a time to you know go a little bit extra so i'm gonna be going in with my kat von d kick pencil liner and i'm going to put this on my waterline <music> Next, I'm gonna grab this shade right here. It's called I'm In It. This one here, I just poked it with my nail. And um, I'm using my lavish pencil brush and I'm just going to use that to put a little bit of a highlight on my eyes to kind of, you know, make them stand out more as if they're not bold enough. I like that because with the red, it honestly almost turned like into a purpley color like holographic -y. yeah it looks purple now okay so now i'm gonna move on to the rest of my face before i finish my eyes and i'm gonna be using my mac studio fix foundation and i'm going to just pump two of those and with my jh03 brush i'm going to apply that Next, I'm going in with my um, Tarte Shape Tape, and I'm going to be putting that on my under eyes, and I'm going to blend this one out with my JH08 brush. Then I'm going to go in and set that with my Kat Von D um, Translucent Pressing Powder and using my JH07. Next step is I'm going to curl my eyelashes and I'm going to be applying mascara. I'm applying the uh, Man Eater. This is from Tarte as well. Next, 
I'm gonna go in with my Studio Fix um, foundation. This is the pressed powder and my JH01 big brush. And I'm going to lightly apply this and just press on the rest of my face. I'm gonna go in with my Morphe um, this is bronzer and I'm going to be grabbing this brush here this is a bronzer brush from Alamar maybe that's how you pronounce it lashes I'm gonna go in with my beauty creations these are in style bougie and I'm going to apply those with my dual clear uh, what is this adhesive Okay, now that my lashes are on, I'm going to just apply a little bit of my highlight. This is the MAC in uh, Show Gold. And I'm going to go in with my JH09 brush. It looks like this. Okay guys, so we're almost done. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my lips now. I'm gonna go in with my MAC. This is in shade Stone. And this is one of my favorite MAC lipsticks. This one in the world, you guys already know that one. I'm literally almost done with this because I wear this for the uh, fall so much because it's just so, it's dark and it's that nice brown. And I match it up with this NYX pencil and this is in shade Brooklyn Thorn. Okay, so now to finish off the look, I'm gonna go with my Urban Decay. This is the oil control setting spray. I'm just going to spray that. Love this one. So that's it guys this is my look inspired by my t-shirt okay guys so that's it for today thank you so much for watching this video i hope you guys like this new concept that i'm coming at you with this entire october month i will be posting a video like i said in the beginning every single week leading up to halloween night where i'm gonna be showing you guys my halloween costume so if you think you know what i'm going to be this year then comment down below what you think i might be also thank you guys so much for watching all my videos i really enjoy doing this for you guys i have a lot of fun creating these looks and um go ahead and try this look out this is an october look this is a halloween vibe look if you want to go out to a halloween party but you don't want to wear a costume then this is something you can go for thank you guys so much for watching my videos and i'll see you on the next one bye <laughs>